Mysterious. Chest should be showing up soon for his Garys. He's their replacement fourth general. As it were. No time like the present. I've got a bunch of rocks and flying, so... Finally that Triton will be able to put himself to use. See, this is why I thought I thought the Triton might be useful. Conditional. Our real target here is gonna be that hot that Tiamat that Zemeckis has. And of course the man himself. probably one of the harder fights we're going to get until we actually try to take out one of the remaining nations. Yeah, look at that guy go when he's actually got water to play in. to effectively forget about the golem. If it catches up, it catches up. I mean, it, there's nothing much I can do about it. Zemeckis will follow after her, but she'll clog everything up nicely.
Look at how nice and clustered that's getting. Ooh, and in perfect range of the angel. Excellent. going exactly as I planned, which is kind of scary. I'm wondering when it's going to start to go bad. and see what goes pop. If you hadn't guessed my overall strategy here, it is new the crap out of everything. Let's see how good his I can only Oh god, no, we're not doing that. Invasion on the water, though. Initial salvo. <laughs> Commencing the secondary salvo. Sing 
precision bombardment strikes. attacking at this point. deem this team good enough to hold this place. Because, I mean, we took it. That's got to count for something. Just imagine, defending it will have all that land support to go with. Imagine how awesome that would be. You know, I don't think I've ever seen any other version of this besides this one either. these guys have become like uber competent badasses while I've been like ah oh, the arm trap again sending them on chain quests let's see what we got here after that one I think Logue is technically badass in terms of ability, he just is so ridiculously subpar in terms of runic power that you're almost not better you're almost better off not bothering. Here we enter the phase where it gets awkward trying to expand. Okay, this guy here is a ninja. Once you once this Garys goes down for the count, one of the ninjas will join your team and then you can then train them. Or well, change add ninja to the male class option.
Alright, what items do we have to use on people? You're empowered by approximately 10, eh? We'll use that agility potion on Dogal. He'd get any more good at class option. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not with a 55 to 58. <laughs> questy, questy. We need to wipe Asgiris off the map. And it's probably gonna be with our leader team. out again soon. Oh, there they go. Oh, and I got Dindan to flee. A two-pronged attack even. I'm impressed. I love the power glove. It's so bad. I don't think it's all that great of an item anyway. So it lives up to its name. Let's see what we've got various people equipped with though. So it's still got the wisdom level. Plus 25 rune power. Could be what he needs. Kirk Windows Pixiat. Anyone around here equipped with things that they don't need? Well, you've got a gram, eh? Yeah, the power glove isn't that bad, I guess. Well, Kai is all cut off with a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, bet they, uh, Bagdamaga just joined them. Yeah, since Bagdamagus joined them, we have effectively no chance of him ever joining us. But the way he works is he will randomly join another country that is not the nation that defeated the one he's currently a member of. What we need to do is find some team to somehow force all this out. It wouldn't take too much, but I don't know if we have that to spare yet. to grind knights. Prepare for boring! Well, I mean, you, you get to watch me do fights and stuff, but... Does that actually have something good and killable there? Half 
hospital. Yeah, we're attacking there. some kind of massive reorganization of room knights and their stuff to actually expand more. Unless we actually put down as Gary's and get a ninja. Come at us! Look at that, 15 hit points and... Wow, I did not expect Lance to just suicidally charge at me like that. I guess he really wants the experience.
I know this is a train everyone up, but I'll take an easy 200 experience to everyone. Also, it's safe to breathe through Lokis, because they don't care. Well, they've, they've got tons of hit points. Oh, he's getting quite strong if he can do that much damage to a Loki. He is only level 12 there, but... not kill that. Shaft continues to grow.
start to be kind of nutty here. Wow. Sometimes the game just suddenly throws something at me and for a win so it occasionally shocks me. something we can't possibly recover from. I'm right at your defeat. You charged the enemy screaming like a lunatic. And... Wow. bit of this defeat is totally all on you. Whether or not, I actually don't want to have another dragon I have to haul around. See if we can't blow it out of the water for experience. Yep. More productive than deleting it. this one.
got a portrait and everything! You're taking this rather well, Balder. Ooh. Burn. Burn. <laughs> that was an epic burn. Much questing. Anyway, let's get some overdue promotions done here. Yeah, she could go to Lancer, but why? She's doing so well as an archer. What's the difference anyway? We're going to have to wait for a bit more runic power. And you need to master your class yet, though you could go to Guardian. What does Guardian have for me? Very, very nice. Area here. She's almost mastered your class, so. And in the other one... Yeah, I'm gonna need to remember that I have to, like... ...reconsolidate and after this. Oh, you did get expert, which means you can finally... You've got a friend who's elected already, don't you? Let's just go right to Saucers. Maybe someone with Fall Bird would be nice. Fido finally gets a class change. Dogal still can't change his class. Anyway, that's figuring out what to do about Esgaris is for next time on Let's Play Brigandine. Later, everyone.